when Showtime said we were going to do one more season, it's eight episodes, we decided that we wanted to try to do those eight episodes as kind of a limited series. And that was a little before everybody was doing limited series. So, you know, we, we did this murder mystery for the whole eight episodes. I'm not sure that it was the best choice. You know, I'm afraid this is going to take a bit longer than we thought. But we'll do whatever you need for us to do. I wanted to pretend like the six didn't, the six didn't happen and that just capped at five. We well, ended at five. Because the show wasn't about a death. The series didn't, that wasn't what that, this whole show was about. We'll cooperate with you. Yeah, we're a very tight-knit group. And uh, we take care of each other. To do a murder mystery maybe was off topic for us, but it was a metaphor. Jenny brought us into this world. Jenny is going to take us out of this world. Want us to come down to the station, right? Oh, that would be great. After six seasons and 70 episodes, the series finale of The L Word aired on March 8th, 2009. In the end, we never actually find out who killed Jenny. What we know for sure is that everybody had a motive, so it's kind of up to viewers to decide who they think had the biggest motive, but we don't get an actual conclusion from the show. But in a way, it's like everyone was responsible for it, because of course that finale reviewed how everyone may have had a reason to kill her. And actually, Eileen Chaikin had a really interesting take on that ending. I think it was me. <laughs> I don't know who else could have done it. None of those girls was a murderer. No, I don't think anybody else killed Jenny. I don't know who did.